got all the edges taped off the opposite or the adjacent panels taped off just so the uh, vinyl doesn't stick to those panels kind of hurts my feelings to take the badge off this is vivid vivid vinyl high gloss epoxy they say this is one of the better ones it's pretty good depth to it a little bit of goo gone or mineral spirits still come off almost there i think that is good as we're gonna get it now this is by no means going to be a how to wrap your fender because i've never wrapped a fender before i guess maybe you just follow along <laughs> I did wash everything with a like a stripping soap and now just have gone over it again with you can use isopropyl alcohol or mineral spirits works good just make sure it's dried thoroughly it's really warm out but I got a heat gun here too so I'll go over it make sure the panel is warm and dry and clean of any chemicals and then I guess we'll start uh, measuring this stuff out.
Oh, well, that's pretty much it, guys. Again, I don't want to say that this is how to wrap your fenders with carbon fiber vinyl wrap, but it's definitely how I did it. <laughs> if you guys want to see the full reveal of these fenders in natural light on this car, uh, go check out my previous video, which is cheapest carbon fiber fenders on your Q50. Um, it's going to be posted probably the video just before this one. So I wanted to do the reveal and then kind of the how to, um, again, not how to, but whatever. Again, this is vivid vinyl. This is the black epoxy carbon fiber, the high gloss epoxy carbon fiber. And I gotta say, it looks really, really realistic. A lot of great depth, a lot of color variation throughout the weave, which really mimics actual carbon fiber. I really like that a lot. I like the fact that it's really close to black and not so gray. The one reason I don't like carbon fiber, especially on black cars, is that it's always too gray and the contrast is just too much. I don't, I don't like it. So I like that this is really, really dark. This light kind of makes it lighten it up, uh, kind of makes it look a little bit lighter, but it's not so bad to work with. It's a really heavy material. It seems like there's a lot of layers uh, to it, so it's really thick. Uh, it doesn't stretch all that much on its own without heat, but being carbon fiber, you don't really want to stretch all that much anyways because you don't want to distort, distort the pattern. Um, so it's pretty easy to work with. I like the heavier material. It seems like it kind of hides your mistakes a little bit more or it uh, handles heat a little bit better when you need to repair some stretch marks or whatnot. Um, so I thought it actually went on pretty smoothly, especially considering the fact that this is the very first time I've ever wrapped a, an actual body panel. My edges and everything turned out really nice. So guys, if I can do this, you can do it for sure. I'm really pumped on how this turned out. Go check out that uh, video, uh, my previous video with the full reveal. You guys are gonna wanna see this in the daylight. So sick, so sick. I just wanted to try something a little bit different. I, I, I'd love to get carbon fiber, real carbon fiber fenders on this. Um, again, just trying to find the ones that actually are more black than gray is the mission. Um, so I thought I'd start out with some vinyl and just see if I actually like the look on a black car. And I gotta say, I do. Whew. Links in the description to the wrap that I used for this project. Uh, it's five feet by six feet and it is barely enough. Use sparingly for two fenders. Again, go check that reveal video out. I think you guys will appreciate it in the sunlight. Other than that, if you have any questions, leave them down in the comment section below. I get to every single one of them as quickly as I possibly can. Thank you guys very much for watching. More stuff coming for the Q50, believe it or not. And more stuff coming for the Z as well. So I hope you guys will stick around. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like the video, please. Comment, share, all that stuff. Let's let's hit 20,000 subscribers. I'm really ready to do a giveaway. Thank you guys very, very much for watching. I appreciate the continued support. We'll see you in the next one.